up on me. What up, though? Now, I don't exactly subscribe to none of these people on Pandora, but I'm letting Pandora play. And when it was hot, it was hot. And when it was not, it was not. However, I just love to praise the Lord, so, you know, that. He saved the day. He will come through. That's what superheroes do. That's why my daddy is my superhero. No greater love. And all I want to do is make him proud of me. Because I don't want to love nobody but him. I don't want to love nobody but I don't want to love nobody. Love nobody but you. I searched all over, literally. I don't want to love nobody but the Lord. And you shouldn't either. Because, uh, you know. Good morning. Good morning. How you doing, Alright, how you doing? So you too, darling. <sighs> oh, that's sweet. And I thought I was looking kind of crappy. So listen, y'all. How y'all doing? What to do? This is the day the Lord has made. We shall and we rejoice and be glad they're in, right? Yeah. So, uh. We gonna do that. <laughs> in spite of what I can knock on them doing, in spite of what what his name is, Nikolai Carpathos, you know, over there in Britain trying to do. You know, in spite of all that stuff, all the do dirt is trying to do, you know, all that. We gonna We gonna watch what superheroes do. My daddy doing some stuff, man. He working on some things. Cause all I want to do is make him proud of me. He gonna be proud of me. He is proud of me. Cause I go against the grain. I I worship him for real. I serve him for real. I rather say for real. I live this thing. I don't I ain't say no game I'm playing. I'm real about this thing. You know. So. I've been looking. You know I've been watching. You know. The Left Behind series. You know. Focusing on that. Checking that out. You know, because we there again, you know. That was when I, way when I was a shorty when it first came out. But uh, I'm looking for the one where they had the Oculus. Like them Oculus y'all playing with right now. Y'all cheering, playing with, playing video games through. Them. I'm looking for that one. I haven't seen that one yet. I'm looking for it though. They ain't, probably ain't going to put it out because it's going to tell too much. But I'm telling you. They got one. Of the Left Behind series that came out way back, way back, way back when it came out, okay? And in this, they have these Oculus glasses. And, you know, it's kind of like the ones you can put your, your, your phone to it like that. And, you know, you can live virtual lives. People live in virtual lives in these Oculus. People got that stuff going on now and projecting, but, you know, they're trying to keep that kind of on low low. Cause they ain't really ready for that you know the world ain't really ready for that you know because um they want us to think it's games they want us to think you know it's just games you know like the distractions they got going on it's a lot of stuff that is questionable but i love the lord and i worship him and I let him do his thing. I ain't finna get caught up in none of that fools. Wake up, it's a new day. You see, when you wrapped up, tied up, tangled up in this thing, for real, baby, you wake up, it's a new day. Wake up, it's a new day. You know, you wake up in your spirit and your soul, knowing that all things work together for the good, then that love God and not be called according to his purpose. So, you know, why well, I'm focusing on what? It's just a lot. Too much. <laughs> now, you got the fallen stars falling. And, you know, technically they're taking each other out. And, you know, what, 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 what. <laughs> the crazy thing about it to me is, it was all about design. You know? And the crazy thing to me is, you know, the way you want to take your own people out. But he, at the end of the day now, the ones that caused us 
pain and anguish. Yeah, you know. The Lord gonna have to deal with them how they deal with them. However, for all you humans that's outside of the matrix and see this thing like it's showing up is, darlings, I'm praying for us. That God keep us covered and keep us lifted. And then in the midst of all that stuff that's going on, there's a lot of stuff that's going on. And if they can keep us distracted in the stuff that's they showing us going on. <laughs> That we can't focus on, you know, God being the ultimate superhero in the, in in this thing. Because at the end of the day, the deity of the Christ is what they after. The power of the Holy Ghost is what they after. And I still got to go back and check out the numbers though, because I ain't seen Pentecost on the calendar. I ain't heard nobody talk about Pentecost. And I'm like, Pentecost is when the church was established. So, you know, whoa, 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 what's going on with that? Is people prepping for that? Is people in the consecration for that? Is people fasting for the power of God? Because that's what the Pentecost is. It's the, it's the power of God. Being made manifest in the earth realm. And, you know, hello. It's a beautiful thing. And that's what we need to be kind of, you know, consecrate, concentrating on and consecrating ourselves to receive the Pentecost, the new Pentecost, because see, you know, them old Pentecostes that they were celebrating wasn't really Pentecostes unto God, they was Pentecostes unto Ra, they was res res resurrecting their church, you know, the one to Ra, the one they worshiping now, the sun God, you know, him, them, and all of them, you know, and Ishtar, and all of them, and Akanaka and them, and them riding them, and all them people, all them things, all them creatures, you know, and and now that we come to the knowledge of the truth and we see that the fallen stars are falling and the lies, lies, rules, and lies that they told us over the years and through our creation, you know, have not been uh, right. They have not been, you know, palatable. They were palatable in the era that we were listening to them because we didn't understand the truth and how music carries spirits and the frequencies of the music. We didn't understand that certain music is certain some sounds attract demonic spirits. We weren't privy to the understanding that that one music is God's language of love. Now Satan was the prince of the air. Satan was Jesus' main, main, that dude was the main, main, that dude was worshiping heaven. That dude played a part in heaven. He he was so beautiful. He had, he played every instrument. His body makeup was uh, was built up of musical instruments. He, he was worshipped. But he wanted to be worshipped. He no longer wanted to worship the creator who created him. He wanted people to worship him. He wanted them to worship him. And that's why the fall, that pride, the fallen angels started to fall. And they still falling. And then you know you got the you got the willing to do workers, willing to do anything for Satan and, and Ra and the evil. But then you got those ones that's really pure in heart and who said you know what you can only come this far you know I'm gonna I'm I'm accept your little gifts but you can only come this far cause I ain't you know I ain't contracted to do this and I ain't contracted to do this, and I sure ain't contracted to do that and it blessed me one time I heard uh, CeCe Whitey when he wanted her to do a song with her. and they was tight you know what I'm saying and CeCe stood up in her holy ghost it says straight up to her girl, you know I ain't finna do that right. <laughs> holy God. She's like a holy indignation. And Winnie could do nothing but respect her Holy Ghost because she was standing on right and righteous. Thank God, kudos to Cece Wiley. I love you, baby. I'm praying for you. But and I, don't, I ain't trying to name drop and all that stuff, but I'm just giving credit credit to what credit is due. She stood for righteousness. And see, that's the problem with us. We stand for everything. If you don't stand for something, you're going to fall for anything. And clearly, you know, look at the world. We fell for everything, them figaros, that whole alphabet soup committee, all that whole pot of gumbo. Whole nasty, burnt roux, scrimps all jacked up and hard, you know, to cook too long, you know, put them in there, you know, too soon, what have you. You know, the uh, crabs ain't, you know, crabbing, you know. <laughs> 
Yeah, you no, know, it's just all oh, this big old pot of nasty gumbo these people done served us. We don't have to regurgitate that. We don't have to throw that up. We don't have to throw that up and let that come out of all the holes everywhere, get delivered from the cares of this world, the rudiments of this world, the actions of this world. You know, because God so loved the world that he gave Jesus that whosoever believeth on Jesus would have everlasting life. You know, and, you know, Jesus, Yeshua HaMashiach, Jesus, the Christ, the Messiah, the Anointed One, Jesus, you know him? You know, the one who hung, bled, and died for us. You know him? The one who is the reason for all seasons and all, you know, reasons to worship God, not Ra. You know him? The reason that many of us are still here, the reason why we have not been consumed by the cares of this world, the reason why we have this peace that surpasses all understanding in the midst of all the chaos and crazy stuff that's going on in the world, the reason, you know, for us being is a mandate. I've been walking around, I've been talking with you. I'm determined to spend more time with you. I've been with you in my soul. My time with you is gonna make me whole. It didn't make him whole, it made him crazy. I don't think he was with Jesus. To say to you, and I came here late. And I'm on my way But I don't want to leave God I don't want to go My time with you, Lord Makes me whole You there Can I take you everywhere? Woo! Everything we share I want to be with you all day I've been walking around I've been talking with you I'm determined to spend more time with you. I've been walking around with you in my soul. My time with you is gonna make me whole. My soul. I just want love for myself. Want to know I'm for myself. <laughs> Anyway, trying to figure out what's really true. Can I take you hear my cry, Lord? I've been walking around, I've been talking with you. We gotta do that. I'm determined to spend more time with you. That's what he want. With you in my soul. We got to have him in our soul. My time with you is going to make me whole. I've been walking around. I've been talking with you. That's what he want us to do. He want us to be determined to spend more time with him. In my soul. My time with you is gonna make me whole. I gotta pray, I gotta pray. It's a mandate, it's a mandate. I gotta pray. It's a mandate. I've been walking around, I've been talking with you. I'm determined to spend more time with you. I've been walking around with you in my soul. My time with you. He got it. He got it. Talking with you. I'm determined to spend more time with you. I've been walking around with you in my soul. 
My time with you is going to make me whole. Our time with him makes us whole. Our time with him makes us whole. Not with houses, cars, land, a man, woman, and both. You know how y'all do it. Time with him makes us whole. So thereby, us being whole in him, then we don't, uh, think of my girl, Cece. Uh, when we spend time with him, then we don't have time for them. When we spend time with him, then he directs us to whom we need to give a lot, a lot time in our presence. Because see, our presence, our presence is priceless. And see what you gon' be. So we gotta learn how to, you know, I'm not the person y'all see. Can't be mad at the things that, cause it built my, it built my muscles. Now I'm stronger than I ever been. You can't stop my hustle. My faith is really strong. It's really strong. That's what's brought me this far. He gonna take you there. And I believe this one's yours. Cause you've been waiting, you've been working. Go get, go get, go get your blessing. We gotta go get it. But how we go get it is in prayer. Through prayer and supplication, make our request be known. Made known to God and the peace of God, which shed a, which cast listen, the peace of God which surpasses all understanding. Man, listen. <laughs> Let me tell you. And in in above everything. Because, I mean, do I sometimes have days where I, you know, feel some type of way? Gotta do something that you never done. Yeah! I do all the time. I stay under war, so sometimes severe warfare. And then here's the thing. When you in that place, in that sucker with God, uh, you know, you got, <laughs> there's levels to this thing. There's every new level, there's a new devil, right? So you got, you know, when, when, when God is giving you certain assignments that are not your average, you know, job, it's like, you know, you, you come under extreme unnecessary warfare. And the amazing thing to me is that he's giving me a circle and I only got, I got a dot. Listen, my circle is small, small, but powerful to God be the glory. But when God is right there at the at the tip of that thing, about to whoop, flip that thing. Everybody, everybody, everybody in the circle. It's gonna be some type of something coming. But we overcome them. <laughs> yeah, I'm God, little ones, for greater is he that is in you and have overcome them. Because greater is he that is in you than he that is in this world. So if greater is he that is in me than he that is in this world, it really doesn't matter. The, the 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 darts, the fiery darts that's thrown at. Why? Because greater is he that is in me than he that is in the world. It really doesn't matter about the fiery dart. Because, you know, I don't focus on that. I focus on my daddy. My Jesus. Cause see if we keep we praise him on credit. We praise him anyway. He in the middle of it. In the middle all day, all day and every day. Anything else, man, that's obsolete foolishness. It's so much, it's, it's so much to give you pause as to the deity of the Christ. It's a lot. And I get it, I understand. I, I, I do, I do. I'm like, you know. However, if he didn't exist, then a lot of us wouldn't. Even some of you do dirties that keep on doing your people dirty. If he didn't exist, then we wouldn't exist. Because if he didn't exist, they'd have took us out way back when they, you know, 
long time ago when they just, uh, you know, when they set up, put the guide stones, resurrected the guide stones, or better yet, when they thought of the guide stones came into play, which, you know, I believe, you know, I believe, I believe, I believe the same people that, you know, the Jetson, me, George Jetson, Jane, his wife, the daughter, Judy, son, Elroy. I don't forgot what the dog name was. But all of that. They would have been here to Jetson age, you know, in, in operation. If we weren't here. If he wasn't living on the inside of us. You know what I'm saying? You got to know him for yourself. And you got to live this thing, see? Unfortunately, we've been taught to disregard his deity. You know, we've been taught to, you know, look at his deity and be like, hmm, I could have done that. Fool, you keep on playing with God like that. No, because see, he could do exceedingly abundantly and above everything, all that we could ask, think, or even imagine. So if he could do abundantly, exceedingly abundantly above all that we could ask, think, or even imagine, and we believe that he could do exceedingly abundantly above all that we could ask, think, or even imagine, then he'll do exactly that. But he got to know that yeah, he can trust us. He got to know that he can trust us that when, you know, the turbulence come and, the, you know, the fire, the waves be, you know, all that in the boat. When Pete was in the boat, the waves, the currents and stuff. He got to know he can trust us. Man, because see, a lot of times we, you know, <laughs> our trust has been breached. Our trust in him, our trust level, our belief system in him has been breached. And, and only because of we have not been privy to certain knowledge and understanding. We have not been taught the truth about certain things. And, it, you know, that's why I'm not mad, per se, at, you know, the D9. I'm not upset uh, with nobody. I'm not upset. I ain't even upset with my haters. Because haters been hating since, you know, creation. They hated Jesus. So if they hated him, I know they're going to hate me because I... I'm, I ain't, I'm, I'm trying to get like my, 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 my big bro, but, uh, you know, <laughs> sometimes that hood come out and be wanting to call, you know, go back to that tribe called Slapper. Who, who, what? And, <laughs> you know, that's why I need him every day. That's why all day I be walking around and I be talking with him all day. I'm determined to spend more time with him all day. For real. I be walking around with him in my soul all day. My time with him is always makes me whole. So that, cause I need him every day, every day, all day. Cause I ain't gonna lie, sometimes, baby. Hallelujah. Ooh, father. Ooh, shamanet kora basobieta. Sometimes. My nerves be like, wait a minute, Lord. Nah. You gonna let it? I be like, what's his name on the Django? Uh, not the spirit that he had, but some of the stuff he said. Uh, the house nigga. Uh, what's his name? Samuel Jackson. What he? Uh, <laughs> who this nigga here? I'll be on this now. <laughs> Sometimes I'll be like, who Lord have mercy. I be sometimes I literally be walking around in these streets like the, 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 the Django. Cause man, look. Some stuff be going on is like what? I be wanting to go be be the Django sister. And like the 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 the, 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 the Django and Denise. That. Cause <laughs> you know, some of his, you know, reasoning was, you know, <laughs> valid. I'm just saying. So sometimes you have reason to get like the, the, the Django, but you can't. That's why I need him every day. I need Jesus every day. Because he keep me grounded. Whew. He keep me grounded. So I don't have to. You don't have to worry about a thing. If you're holy and righteous. Said I never seen the righteous forsaken. I never seen it. I ain't never seen it. Never. 
seen the righteous forsaken or a seed begging for bread. So if you've never seen the righteous forsaken or a seed begging for bread, then do it. And uh, just like we gotta go ahead and trust the Lord, huh? No matter what it looks like, right? Good morning. We gotta trust him when we can't trace him. Trust him when you can't trace him. And sometimes you can't trace him. Lord have mercy sometimes you really can't trace him. Sometimes you be like, Lord, what the world? Did you see that? Lord, did you see that? Lord, did you see these knuckles knocking like they acting? You know? <laughs> sometimes you gotta be like that. Because, whew. And give it back to him. Because they're his people. That's why we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principalities, powers, and wicked rulers of high places. It's principalities, powers, wicked rulers of high places. Principalities, powers, wicked rulers of high places. Spiritual wickedness in high places. That's why we have to keep on the armor, the armor, the helmet of salvation, the breastplate of righteousness, our waist girded about with truth, our feet shut with the preparation of the gospel of peace, and the sword of the spirit is the shield of faith. You gotta keep that every day, man. All day, man. All day. I be walking around and I be talking with him. Literally. You better ask my people. Sometimes I hear he'll close me up, you know, just take me out, out all the way out of conversation. I be sitting there talking to you and at the same time talking to the Lord. I'm listening to you, but I'm listening to the Lord. Because a lot of times you gotta hear what people saying inside of what they're saying. You hear Corey talking? She's singing for me. Cause he gon' step in and make it all right. Won't he do it? He said he would. Fight your battles for you. They gon' wonder how you sleep at night. They wonder now. Anybody tell you something different, you know that's a lie. You gon' look back and be so amazed. How it turned out. <laughs> Won't he do it? They're going to be like, oh, Lord, uh, the Lord has not been done it. In spite of all the wishy majiggy stuff they try to do. Listen, I'm about to let them know where I'm from. Don't take me there again. I just call on Jesus, my friend. Get me back in line one more time because he's always listening. Ain't nobody perfect. Everybody's hurting. Save me from my weaknesses. But you're always on time. He always on time. Get your breakthrough, because I'm going to get mine today. Yeah. Fight your battles for you. They going to wonder how you sleep at night. Y'all know they wonder. I know y'all wonder. Anybody told you something different, you know that's a lie. You going to look back and be so amazed. How it turned out, it's only his grace. It's only his grace. It's only his grace that some of us men listen. You see what the enemy planned for my downfall Turned out to be the greatest victory of my life Cause when it comes out your fast and hard There's only one that could come and make it right So ain't no need for stressing and crying Cause he gon' show up just like he did the last time And the last time And the last time I know, I know, I know I know it I know it. That's why I, I know he fight my battles. I know folk be wondering how I sleep at night after all the stuff that they done done to me. And you know, they gonna look back, they still looking back and being so amazed how I turned out. It's only his grace. Because he always do it. Because I trust him at all times. I do. In the good time, in the bad time, in the ugly times, in the indifferent times, when in the times, you know, where stuff be going on and going wrong, I trust it. Nah. Um. Thank y'all for walking with me. I be grateful that he allowed me to move how I move. Because when he allowed me to, to move how I move, he get the glory. And I 
every time. Because the thing ain't about me. It ain't never about us. Ever. And that's where the former church, I saw a video this morning and ran across me like this, where the man of God said that some churches are going to be closing because God ain't in them and because they didn't give God the glory and God not going to share his glory and that they had tainted God's people so God wouldn't allow them to advance the kingdom so a lot of ministries, you know, gonna be shut down. Now, a lot of them ain't, because some of them covered. But he, what he said was true. And you can see it all over the world. Oh, oh, oh. Uh-oh. Oh, oh, oh. He'll bring it to the light. <laughs> Hypocrite. Time to get it right. See, I include myself. See, he included himself. I cast my own stone. I'm the man in the mirror, y'all. I can see my wrong. But I'm here by faith. I pray he gets saved for real. I had to open up my mouth and say, Give me that joy that I can't explain. Extra peace that'll leave the pain. I want that love that'll never change. Give me that. Give me that. Give me that power to walk away. When another God wants to take your place. As much of you as I can take. Give me that. Give me that. Ain't hey, listen, you want the show to end. Get the actors off stage. And let church begin. Do you want a revolution? God is cleaning up house. At first, he started right at home. No more miracle water. <laughs> Listen, everybody got a title. But do you know your name? Well, I said. Fall on our face. Think everything that in me that's not right, take it away. Joy that I can't explain. And extra peace that I'll ease the pain. I want that love that'll never change. Give me that. Give me that. Ooh, I want the power to walk away. When another God wants to take your place. As much as you as I could take. Give me that. Give me that, oh, give me that joy that I can't explain. And it should be so easy pain. I want that love that'll never change. Give me that, give me that. Ooh, I want the power to walk away. When another God wants to take your place. As much of you as I can take. Give me that, give me that, oh, give me that. I can't get away. You see, there's no mistake. You see what you've done to me. I'm not the same old me. You took away everything. And now you're my everything. He's my everything, y'all. I can't get away. See, there's no mistake. You see what you've done to me. I'm not the same on me. You took away everything. And now you're my everything. And to the nostrils of man. Creation before time began. Listen. The God who orchestrates the future At the same time he knows where you are Cause he owns all the cattle on the hill He has a plaza enough to pay all my bills And give me that joy That's the one I'm talking about Give me that joy That's what I'm talking about 
ये मेरे ये मेरे Give me that joy I can't explain And extra peace that I'll ease my pain Want that love that'll never change Give me that, give me that Give me that power to walk away When another God wants to take your place As much of you as I can take Give me that, do you want that? All of that Man, that come with fasting and prayer And go through, man that love that'll never change In the midst of folk trying to play on your top You still gotta love them Power <laughs> As much of you as I can take Joy I can't explain oh, Joy I can't explain I'm at a loss for words Oh Oh, 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 I'm so happy. You make me happy, love. Yeah, 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 yeah. Joy I can't explain. And extra peace, and, and extra peace that'll ease my pain. I want that love that'll never change, y'all. Give me that. Give me that. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> That right there. See, we need some of that. Every day, man. Every day, all day. Because I be walking around and I be talking to him all day. I'm determined to spend more time with him all day. All day. At, on the job, off the job. When I'm working, when I'm not working, when I'm in a chop shop. You know. We got to have that thing every day, all day. And that's what sustains us. And that's what gives us the peace that surpasses all understanding. And that's what gives us the love that'll never change. Because he never changes. He don't ever change. He always remains the same. Humans, nine babies, unfortunately. Humans are fickle. And, you know, sometimes, you know, humans are, well, humans are the reason we're in this conundrum right now. Because the humans believe the lies, lies, the women's lies. And now that the Lord is waking us up. And, you know, you know, everybody, you know, figuring out what the purple rain is. And why the purple rain exists. And folks trying to come out the purple rain. You know. Let God be God. And let every devil be alive. <coughs> you see how the enemy be doing? I know he want me to shut up. But I can't. It's like fire. Shut up in my bones. <laughs> Literally. It be like that. But I've been walking for ooh, almost 40 minutes. I don't know how many times I done went around the miracle round. But I don't know. Hope was seven times. Because God needs to change some things, some shifts, shifts of things in the atmospheres and the hemispheres. And in the stratosphere, you know, and he doing it. We just gotta trust him, and we can't lead to our own the natural finite understanding because our little natural finite understanding is, you know, finite. When we dealing with an infinite God, how you limit him? How you put a how can you put a uh, ceiling? How can, how, you can't do that with God. He's omnipotent. Omniscient. Oh, Lord. Omnipresent. He everywhere at the same time. He see everything at the same time everywhere. And he's more powerful. It's all powerful. Powerful, powerful. Hello. Powerful, powerful. He's so powerful. That you know, demons tremble at his name. <laughs> oh Lord! They do. They tremble at his name. And who wouldn't serve a God like this? Y'all, 
that's uh Pandora. So I ain't got no rights to none of this music and I don't fool with none of them people. But I sang some of these songs. You know. But uh I love y'all. You tuning in Lady D, the truth seeker. I always come to y'all on the ones and twos. I ain't never about too much trouble, but I'm always a little pressure. <laughs> I'm always a little pressure whether I'm church fitted up, gospel gangster fitted up, or street fitted up. However, you know, however I come, I'm always going to be a little pressure. Even if I come looking bunny, I'm still, it's going to be a method to my madness if I do that. It's going to have to be, because I don't do that. <laughs> My worst days, I look good. I look good. I look fine. I look, yeah, that. And all the glory belongs to God. All of it. Literally. That's why I be so grateful. Because ain't nothing, it's nothing. I ain't got nothing to do with nothing. I just do what he say. When he say it, how he say it. You know? And I let him do what he do. In and through me. And I don't be knowing what he be doing, what he be doing. So that's amazing. That's that's how he lets me, you know, lets it flow. And I believe it's so that I don't try to take his glory like a lot of y'all have, unfortunately. But uh, yeah, I got to go. <sighs> but I love y'all. I'm holla child whenever I holla child. Whenever I holla child, gonna be when I holla child. You know. One love. It's only one love. The kingdom of God in heaven, darling. Straight up. It's just me. Little old Lady D. Coming to y'all on the ones and twos. I really, 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 really love you. Check out Lady D.